Welcome to Silverstone. It's October the 31st and we're here on the Grand Prix circuit with motor racing legends. It's the second edition of the Pal Mal Cup, a race that we came up with in conjunction with Duncan Wiltshire at Motor Racing Legends just last year. It's been extremely popular and successful and it's basically a three hour race with three different grids in one race. Yesterday we had the A1 Cup with GC40s. this, the Pal Mal Cup, the big one. It's a three hour race, but unlike the three hour races, it has a unique element to the format. We have a class structure, we have pre-66 GT cars, so that's Cobras and E-types. Pre-63 GT cars, so that's also earlier E-types, earlier Cobras, Heelys. And then we have the pre-60 cars for 50 sports cars, things like Mr. Jaguars and Lotus 15s. But the unique aspect to the Pal Mal Cup is the winner of the big trophy, the Pal Mal Cup, is actually the winning team. So one entrant from each class makes a team of three and the team which overall on aggregate does the best wins overall in the Pound Mile Cup. And it's that unique feature that makes this race different to all the others. I'm in a team with uh, sharing a pre-63 E-Type with Jeremy Cottingham and also in our team is James Cottingham and Richard Cook in the dark blue Cobra and Max Gerardo and James Cottingham in the dark blue and white Lister. As a result of our sponsorship of the event, we've also got a selection of sales cars here today, paraphernalia laid out all over the place, and we're having a great time. It's a really nice way to finish the season. So let's watch what happens and unfolds today with a three hour race, where we have two mandatory pit stops for every car. So you have a combination of almost three or sometimes two drivers per car to see how people get on. Each pit stop is five minutes long, where you're allowed to refuel. And at the end of three hours, the winners of each class are combined together to see who receives the Pall Mall Cup, the overall winners of the event. 